Hello guys, my name is Umar and welcome back to another movie review. Of course, you can say it's been a minute, it's been a long time, or even it's been a while, whatever you want to say. But I'm back here today doing a review of Bad Boys for Life. You heard that right, man. I really enjoyed watching this movie, man. I have to tell you, man, these guys about that A game, bro. I'm talking about cast and crew, especially though, Will Smith and Martin Lawrence, man. They These guys still have the sauce. They still have the chemistry and they're still young, man. These guys not going anywhere anytime soon. I already can tell you that. This movie, first of all, I want to just start with the visual beauty of it, man. What the, what, 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 what are you, what is this, man? That's some next level shit. Next generation shit. It's like a PS5 type shit. But anyway, man. The directors, Bilal uh, Fala and uh, Adil Al Arabi, Islam Alaikum, brother. You guys did an amazing job, man, with that, bro. You guys just did a phenomenal job, man. And you can tell these two guys were having so much fun, man. I was watching uh, some of the videos from uh, behind the scenes of the movie. Their interactions with the lead characters, uh, Will Smith and Martin Lawrence, plus all the cast and crew. They were laughing. They were, you know, they were just enjoying themselves. Well, I mean, what's the point if you're doing something and you're not having fun with it? What's the point? I mean, like, it makes perfect sense, but, you know, it's just, it is what it is, you know, but, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm saying it this way so that you can know. Yes, yes. But, you know, this was good, man. This was really well done. You know, you would think that, like, uh, with the movies trying to do, like, a sequel or, like, a, a remake, sometimes it doesn't work. You know, I don't care if it's 40 years later, 25 years later, or even... 10 months later, it just doesn't come out right. These guys, these guys really delivered, man. All the, all the cast and crew, the lead characters, these two directors, I hope to see them back, I swear. I don't care if it's a bad boy movie or whatever. I just want them to do another action comedy based movie or if, even if it's not a comedy, any other action movie, I would love to see them do another project in a big way possible. I think they're from Belgium. I think, I think they're from Belgium. I'm not quite sure. But I think they're from Belgium. Well done, brothers, man. Well, ve very well done, man. Well, well done, well done. Thank you. And uh, the sound, man, like all the elements, really, like the dialogues, the monologues, sound effects, and music, like the, the consistency and the music is just some next level shit. It's like the opening scene, like just how they how they open the scene, opening scene is like, holy shit, it just happens. You're sitting there like, it's happening, it's happening, it's happening. And it's just downhill from there in a good way, of course, man. When I say downhill from there, I mean it in a good way. So just get that shit right. You feel me? So yeah, they told me that I'm going to need a dialect coach after this because my American accent is not working. So I'm going to need a dialect coach for me to get in this uh, uh, movies and shows, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get that right though. I'm gonna get that right one day, you know. We'll, we'll, we'll make it happen, but uh, yeah, well done, man. If you haven't seen this movie, you gotta go see it, man. Don't get your ass. Let's see, I would appreciate. I'm sure we're gonna have him back. Uh, Will Smith and Martin Lawrence, uh, Mike Lowry and um, Marcus Burnett. I would love to see them back, but on the other hand, I want to see those two directors do another bad boy movie please will smith you're the producer you know you produce this movie and i think will smith and uh uh and some other guy i think brooks sherman or some of, i was reading an article about it but and I, and I think it's three guys but will will smith you know will smith you you're part of this production so please sir you must bring them back if you're gonna do another bad boys movie and i'm sure you're gonna be in it i would love that you gotta be in it whatever you know that's your movie but man, it's it's very exciting. I I hope to see another one, like I said. But I don't want it to be. I don't want to wait long time for it. So uh, you know, just uh, Will Smith, when you're doing the the next one, please, uh, if you can let me know, at least give me like uh, extra, you know, to be extra in in the movie, please, if you don't mind, because I really love these movies and I want to be in it. Thank you so much. So yeah, like I said, man. Go see this shit, man. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna enjoy it. And uh, I cannot wait. It's the best way when it comes to movies. It's the best way to open it, and the best way to open 2020 period when it comes to movies because this was good. And 25 years later, we're still here. They still look the same, and the chemistry is still there. Thank you so much for watching this video. This is it for me. I'm giving Bad Boys 10 out of 10 because. 
I don't I don't like I don't like to lie and I don't like liars. I don't I don't like to fake it. Just be real about it. If someone did a good job on something, just say they they did a good job. Don't 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 hate. Don't don't do that. So just be honest about it. That's why I'm giving bad boys for life 10 out of 10 with my African accent. So uh thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it won't be long before I see you guys because I, i'm trying to do another video about like my most anticipated movies of 2020 and bad boys uh, for life was one of them so you know you already heard me do the review i loved the movie i enjoyed it so i'm gonna see what am i gonna do next you are fair me uh bro take it easy and i'll see you in the next one take care brothers and sisters like subscribe and share bye